a video on the software Connect for Windows SDK Beta. The latest software will be released uh, in one day, actually. So, uh, but I just want to show that I was able to get uh, some of the programs working. I was able to, you know, get the Connect drivers installed, everything working. Uh, so I just wanted to do an example of the Skeleton Viewer, which I think is one of the coolest software, coolest software that they have for it. Um, as you can see here, uh, it's going to pick me up, and you can see that it has, uh, you know, where my where my elbows are, where my neck is, uh, even where my knees are, ankles. Uh, this is a little slower because I have so much software run right now. Um, but this is just great. I'm really happy to get this running uh, and working. And with this uh, software and this information, I'll be able to, you know, develop on it uh, and uh, alter it for my uh, pro my project that I'm working on. I also did get the uh, the audio recorder which was the very first one that I did get working. I was very excited about that when I first got it up and running. Um, the default time was, I think, tw 10 or 20 seconds. I changed it to 300. Uh, just kind of, you know, messing around, look at the code. Uh, you can see here that it's going to pick up um, me talking, uh, the, the beam direction, if it changes, and the sound source position. So if I move around the room, and talk, it'll eventually pick me, pick up on me moving because it's a little slower. Like I said, I have more software running, but you know this is this is great. Uh, I figure what I can do is I can modify this software, get it so that way it prompts the user to save it, or you know have a click a button to start it and stop it, pause it, just like a normal recorder, and uh, develop on it, alter it for my project. And, you know, even though, you know, when you close out, it does save it. It saves it as a uh, out uh, file. And, uh, you know, it re you know, writes over it every time you reset, you know, save it. So, if I could, you know, alter it, make it prompt the user to save it in a different area where the user wants to put it instead of having to look through uh, folders upon folders. But, I did want to show the testing I made you know, I, you know, I did for the, the Connect for Windows SDK beta and I uh, hope you enjoyed it.